Welcome back to Real Gospel with the X-Men. We number one, baby! Family, hour number two of Real Gospel. My name is the X Man, your radio minister of music. This is evangelist, preacher, teacher Pam Crawford with Restoration on Real Gospel. Restoration is coming to your house. I'll restore the years the enemy has. I'll give you double, double for your trouble. Oh, I'll do it for you. I'll do it for you, says the Lord. Sing with me. Restoration, it's coming. It's coming to your house. The enemy has stolen. The enemy has stolen. I'll give you double, double for your trouble. Your trouble.
Gospel is the place where God gets the glory and artists tell their stories. It's an honor to have my good friend, preacher, teacher, evangelist, a songwriter, Pam Crawford, with us on Real Gospel. And when I say good friend, I really do mean good friend. Pam Crawford, thank you and welcome back to Real Gospel. Thank you. And so since the last time we spoke, um, you were uh, uh, that, the last time we spoke, you had just finished uh, a song on Bishop Jerry L. Maynard presents the Cathedral of Praise Choir. That CD project was hot and uh, still is vicariously. And so now since then, you have been um, you've released a, a dynamic single. I love the single Restoration. And you have just been uh, taken off and, and touring and singing all over the country. So what, what, what else has been going on? on with you sister Pam <laughs> oh thank you that is what has been going on and of course you know on October the 24th I will be doing my first uh, live recording as a solo artist and so I am so thankful to God for fulfilling the promise that he made me Amen. So you'll be here in Nashville, back in Nashville, uh, Saturday, October 24th at the uh, True Way Church. Is that correct? That is correct. Where Bishop Davenport. Bishop Davenport. Hey, Bishop Davenport. And so, uh, <laughs> so the live CD, is this your first? This will be my first. Mm, okay. Yes. Okay. Yes. And so how does it feel? Well, before we get into that, tell the listeners a little bit about who Pam Crawford is, just in case they found the Lord uh, yesterday, they got saved and <laughs> sanctified and turned it all over to Christ, and they've been listening to secular music all their lives, and so now they're, the, they're discovering the wonderful world of the best music in the world, gospel music. Who is Pam Crawford? Well, Pam Crawford is originally from Chicago. I had the honor uh, of singing with two of uh, the world's greatest choirs, uh, Brother Milton Brunson and the Thompson Community Singers, along with the uh, Chicago Mass Choir. Uh, songs like Safe in His Arms, I Can Go to the Rock, Don't Stop Praying, and so many others that I had the honor to, to perform with those, with those two groups. Amen. You know, speaking of the Chicago Mass, I spoke with, um, oh gosh, what is her name? What is her name? She's one of the founders of the Chicago Mass Choir. Dr. And Feronda Williams. There, yes. And I mentioned your name and she just lit up. She said, oh yes, oh we love Pam Crawford. Oh, we miss her so much. <laughs> and um, we were supposed to do something a while back, but our schedules uh, got conflicted a little bit. But um, she left the door open that she would love for you to to come back together and do something in the near future. So I just thought I would let you know what she <laughs> said. So yeah, I appreciate that. <laughs> yeah, yes, yes. So, but yes, um, sir. yeah. So um, the live CD recording. What what can we expect from this CD? We are going back to church. Uh, I have the honor of working with uh, Harold J. McCord. Yes, um, Brother Harold. Praise Radio. Yes. yes. And the Laura Music Group, and we are just going to go back to church. I believe that God is going to move mightily in that recording, so I believe in my heart that it will be like none other uh, recording that people have had the opportunity to attend, uh, but we're going to have church. I'm, I'm telling you right now, if, if, you're, if you don't have any plans to meet us there, because we are going to have an awesome time in the Lord. Amen. So what can we expect? What, what songs uh, on this CD project should we just be on the lookout for? What songs are speaking to the hearts? Well, I guess it's speaking to your heart and your mind first. So what songs are we looking out for that the people are just going to be just overwhelmingly blessed in the things of the Lord? Oh, we have songs like uh, Can't Give Up Now, Look to Jesus. Uh, another song called Walk, um, another song, Stand By Me, which is an old hymn that I learned long years, many years ago. My grandmother asked me to learn that song, and it has really, really stuck with me for most of my life. You can look for songs, um, worship songs, uh, some somewhat contemporary, uh, traditional music. So it's going to be a different variety of all of them. Amen, amen. So, um, can't give up now. Walk, yes. stand by yes. me. 
You know, I've been I've been knowing you for a few years now, and for those people who are uh, listening, and so they're starting to put this together because this program mm-hmm. is, is is syndicated and heard all over the world. Um, mm-hmm. Pam Crawford and I are 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 former our church members, so to speak, and so uh, I've been knowing you for a few years, and so uh, some of these songs uh, are probably near and dear to your heart. Uh, can't Absolutely. give up now and walk and Absolutely. stand by me. So the the process by which you are ministering in song and in spirit, um, this music. Speak to the people who uh, who look at the title of these songs like I am, and they just don't know uh, what you've been through and what it's taken to get to this point. And you know, speak to the people who who need to hear that word from you right now, and and they they can't make it to Nashville to come see you a um, minister in this life. Live CD recording. Speak to those people as to when the project is available that they should understand why it's so important for them to pick it up. Uh, these songs that, that we will be doing, they really tell the journey that I have gone through uh, since leaving Chicago, being here in Nashville, and, and all of them, they speak to me first. And it tells a story, really, of my journey and what I have had to deal with. And these songs really say what I did to overcome the things that I have have been through. The Bible says that many are the afflictions of the righteous, uh, but God, He delivers us out of all of them. And so these songs speak to that journey. It tells a story of my life and how I overcame. I often say, sometimes... I can sing my way out of a situation uh, from a song that I may have sang or a, a song that I heard from someone else that really speak to my heart and they encourage me, they lift me, they, they give me strength. And so all of the music that's going to be a part of this project really speaks to the journey that I have, uh, that I have gone through, the things that I have dealt with and how I overcame. Um, you know I'm a preacher too, but I'm That's a singer right. as well, and those songs really speak of my journey and how God has lifted me and how He has kept me and what I did. You know, look to Jesus is what I had to do. I had to realize I can't give up. I've come too far. I know too much. God's been good to me, and I'm going to walk this path that He has laid for me. We have to understand that God has a plan for all of us, but the plan was never ours. And so even on, even in the, the plan that God has, the purpose for our lives, there are things that we will encounter. But these songs, they give you strength. They'll give you strength. They'll encourage you. They'll let you know you can make it through anything, that God will never leave you. He won't forsake you. He will always be there for you. Mm, mm, mm. See, you're preaching already. And see, <laughs> for those who have never seen you or witnessed you uh, when you're mm-hmm. singing, you seem to um, go from zero to praise like a, a, a Lamborghini. It's like, <laughs> boom! And all of a sudden, you know, the atmosphere is just saturated with the Holy Spirit. So what's going on in your mind when you're ministering? Because, I mean, for people who have never seen you live, oh my gosh, they're just in for a treat because you you go there you take us there what is going on with you mentally and and, and spiritually that you just sort of just become the instrument you truly become the voice of the Lord one of the things that I have learned uh, is that this is not about me this is about encouraging someone else so at first I'm really ministering to myself and at the same time I'm asking God to take over because this is his gift and his purpose and I want him to use it to reach. If it's just one person that it reaches, then I, I have done my job. Uh, but mostly I'm ministering to myself. I'm thinking about what I'm saying and how it's ministering to me. It, I believe if you, can't, if, if you haven't experienced or you're not living what you're singing, you're not effective. And so I live these songs. I live them. I won't sing them if I don't understand them. I won't sing them if they not if they're not ministering to me. And so I minister to myself first, uh, encourage myself first, and then 
after that, God just takes over and I have no control. <laughs> None. I yield totally to the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Well, Sister Pam, uh, we look forward to having you here in the city of Nashville at the True Way Church Saturday, October 24th. And for those uh, individuals listening right now who need to find out more about you, more about um, the CD project, how to reach you and how to invite you to a city, a state, maybe even a country, (laughs) where can they reach you at? They can find me on Facebook. Uh, I have a Facebook page, Pamela Crawford. They can find me on Twitter at Just Pam Music. Um, and of course, they can uh, look up the Laura Music Group uh, if, for, you know, information uh, that they need and, and how to reach me. Amen, amen. And um, I also want to thank um, Bishop Davenport for giving uh, you this platform at, at his ministry. The, um, also, the people who are coming is going to be a, a great night. Uh, yours truly, yeah. the X Man. I am one of the hosts. And so I yeah. think I'm scheduled to introduce you. And so I'm nervous about that. But you know what? I'm not <laughs> going to let you down. I promise you that I will do you justice because this CD project has been uh, uh, long coming. Because I remember you walking by in the halls and I would tap you on the shoulder and say um, Sister Pam um, when are you going to do your own stuff it's time for you to write your own music I remember the time you turned to me and said you know what I'm on it um, um, it's, I, I, you know what I, it's, it's coming and then a few yeah. months after that you say you know uh, this guy Harold McCord you know we, we, we got together and he's in, he's in Alabama and we're working on that project and then here we are God is yes, just so absolutely, good. Absolutely, absolutely, and I too want to thank this. And, I'm sorry, Bishop Davenport and the True Way Church for opening their doors. I do appreciate that greatly. Amen. The one, the only, Sister Pam Crawford, uh, my sister in Christ. I love you in Christ, and um, I, your music will continue to be supported here. Your music will continue to be uh, played here. And I don't know about you all listening right now, but restoration has come to my house. I don't know about yours. So, yeah, thank you so much, Pam Crawford, for joining us on Real Gospel. Thank you so much for having me. Coming up is your real flashback song of the hour. But you know what? What flashback song would you like to hear? I'm taking your requests at Real Gospel with the X-Man on Facebook and also Real Gospel X-Man Twitter. Real flashback songs. Songs that are not traditional, not old school, but they sort of fit in the middle gap. You know, songs that just give you a flashback. If you're not familiar with a flashback song, don't go anywhere. Don't you dare move because you're in for a treat. Yes, indeed. My name is the X-Man, and your real flashback song of the hour is up next. You're listening to Real Gospel with the X-Man.